Hello, and welcome to another episode of Little Known Facts. In today's episode, we're going to take a look at the UK's nuclear waste problem. The UK currently has eight operational nuclear power plants with a total of 15 reactors. As of 2016, these reactors were producing a total of 72 terawatt hours of electricity. This accounts for some 21% of total energy produced in the UK each year. That's enough energy to power almost 16 million UK homes. Or with the same energy, you could charge your iPhone 64 billion times. So, we know that nuclear is a massive portion of energy in the UK, making it an important player in the UK's overall energy strategy. But what about the waste? Well, before we talk about the waste, let's first explore what nuclear waste is. The Nuclear Decommissioning Authority describes nuclear waste as follows. Radioactive waste is any item or substance that has no further use and that contains radioactivity above certain levels defined in legislation. First up is very low level waste. This waste has radioactivity levels so low that it can be stored in the same waste dumps as household waste. Next is low level waste. Typically, this is smaller items from around the nuclear power plant, such as the protective shoe covers or clothing worn by the workers there. After low level waste comes intermediate level waste. This is usually larger structural items from the plant itself, such as large blocks of concrete or asphalt. It could also be the chemical sludge, which is produced as a byproduct of many of the processes at the plant. And finally, high level waste. This waste has the highest levels of radioactivity and produces a considerable amount of heat along with it. Often this is the spent fuel rods from inside the reactors themselves. This stuff is so radioactive that before long-term storage it is stored underwater for the first 50 years. Some elements in high level waste can remain radioactive for 24,000 years. Over the next 100 years, the UK will produce another 4.9 million tonnes of nuclear waste. Now this may sound like a lot, but to put that into perspective, this could be stored using the same surface area as Wembley Stadium, and with a height of just a two-storey building. And this is a total waste predicted for UK nuclear energy all the way until 2125. That's over 100 years from now. Now, let's compare that to the household waste, which as of 2016, the UK was putting 52 million tonnes of waste into landfill each year. So, does the UK have a nuclear waste problem? Well, it doesn't look that way. And although nuclear waste comes with many more challenges than normal household waste, the much smaller amount makes it much more manageable. If you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like and subscribe for more little known facts.